for decades. Almost everything we knew about the Maya came from studying a handful of seemingly isolated cities. Most Maya cities have never been touched since they were abandoned over 1,200 years ago, which means that our understanding of this civilization is based on just pinpricks of information. But the LiDAR project is giving archaeologists a vast map, not only of these cities, but everything that lies between. And that's throwing up some massive surprises. Just one of them is Francisco's newly discovered remote structure, a seven-story high pyramid. Oh, it gives you, like, chills up your back. Until the new LiDAR survey, it was completely unknown to archaeologists. Built on a summit that first had to be leveled by hand, an extraordinary human effort itself. We just followed a map created by lasers in the sky, using a helicopter to get into the jungle, and then bushwhacked for hours to this point to find this. A group of people, they put their blood, their sweat, their tears, and possibly their lives into the creation of this pyramid. But the greatest mystery is why the Maya built this pyramid in such a remote place at all. Its high position, commanding views in every direction, makes Francisco believe it could have been a watchtower. And that supports a new and radical idea that's been thrown up by the project. Does the data show you that they were fighting more than we thought before, or? Oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. And Way more than we thought. Before the new LiDAR survey, archaeologists had found little evidence of large-scale warfare in the Maya world. But that's suddenly changing. Because the LiDAR is showing up massive defensive structures. The whole ridge is fortified. They are protecting themselves here. 12 miles to the west of Tikal, the team have just found an immense fortification at the top of a steep escarpment. This was a self-sustaining fortress. They were ready to be under siege here. The ways in which they've taken mountain sides and put huge trenches in them, the ways in which they actually have supplied these uh, fortresses with water, that they were building reservoirs on the tops of mountains, uh, these are things that we had absolutely no idea about. Even at the powerful Tikal, a colossal defensive structure surrounds the city. This is like the Great Wall of Tikal. That's incredible. Up to 12 feet high and thought to be more than 10 miles long, the wall is far more than an indication of the scale of Maya conflict. But evidence of the ability of the Maya to tame the jungle around them. 